Hello there, and welcome to Hammerman for today, April 9th. Ha! I got it right this time. It's awesome. Okay, so well, hopefully the thumbnail's right. We'll, we'll get to that when we get to that. Uh, I, I wanted to kind of throw a few wrenches in the gears today. Uh, 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 I forget how to talk because I've got a dog wiggling around beside me and it's very distracting. Um, my my new co-host of all of the Hammermans, uh, probably not, probably just this one because he's already going insane, is Indy, my dog. He's very good. He uh, barks a lot. You've definitely heard him squeak toys in the background. That's, that's a treat. He likes to eat those. Um, so... Oh, God, the slobber. Oh, the slobber is real. Anyways. Wait, hold on. Can I, can I, oh. Um, I like him anyways. I don't know. He's a good boy. Doing things a little differently. Normally, I don't bother with the prototypes, and I try to mess around, and I try to do things and whatnot. In this particular case, uh, the exact opposite. I pretty much rolled through all of Hammerman exclusively because of these two level two hot pockets. Uh, they are both, I, I guess, level two or stage two or skilled. Oh, man, uh, hi puppy. So I, uh, he, he, yeah. Um, I, I, I did change it up obviously uh, just because got to do something different every once in a while aside from last week where I actually was out of town uh, in the bottom right hand corner there well I guess not really the whole bottom right hand corner and you can't see it technically right now because the insert is sitting there but uh, down there is my gold statue ah now you can see it because I I basically hit Hammerman like twice all weekend I had other things going on um, and so I, I didn't have the opportunity to crab nearly as much. I apologize to everyone who was hoping for some, uh, some crab meat or crab videos or crab meat videos. Meet the crabs. Uh, so yeah, I just, I, and like, I didn't even do a hammerman last weekend cause I was like, you know what? It's just, it's not going to happen, which is one of the reasons that I have the two Hot Pockets, because I was just like, okay, I am going to have to, like, play Hammerman and get through it, because I, I just can't pass on that, but I want to do it in the easiest, laziest possible way, and last weekend we even had the Hot Pocket level 2 boost, so they were almost like threes, and I tell you, they, like, I wish I had been recording because they destroyed Hammerman, it was absolutely ridiculous, and it was a ton of fun, um, but now I have these weird Hot Pockets just kind of hanging around, and I was like, well, the solution to that is Hot Pocket Mania on Hammerman. Wow, he is still going, eh? Um, Indy. Why don't you uh, share with the people what your thoughts are on the subject? Yep, yep, pretty much what I thought. Food. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the only thought that goes through this thing. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, <laughs> because it's a little weird uh, having, you know, the Hot Pockets, the first couple of levels really get absolutely fried with not even a blink when you have the two hot pockets down. I was kind of surprised at how difficult, I think it was stage two or three was, and four as well, where I was just like, oh, I don't have an, I don't even understand. I got all these hot pockets here. I got all these craziness. I got max defenses and somehow still like my base is getting pretty thoroughly thrashed. And I kind of feel like if you are a much lower, uh, much lower level, it would get much more difficult. Oh, 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 jeez. Oh, things are going horribly wrong. There we go. Hold on. Come on. Indy, hey. Indy, oh. oh. <laughs> All right, so as you can probably... <laughs> oh, things are going horribly. They're just melting down. Here you, here you go, bud. Have a, have a treat. Um, sorry, like... Keyboards were getting mashed. I've got treats smeared all over my pants. 
I, I don't even understand what's happened here. Uh, but thank you for joining us, Indy. Uh, good luck. And uh, the top of your head is still showing, so that works. I don't even remember what I was talking about. Oh, yeah, so the Hot Pocket, <laughs> she's been dying. Uh, they, well, it died, but, like, it did defend. It just was really kind of crazy. But now we're getting to the serious stuff. Stage 6, a... Uh, Scorcher followed just by, like, an army of rifles and healers and all kinds of craziness. Uh, I would strongly suggest figuring out where that, um... The, the Scorcher, like, the path that Scorcher's gonna take, and put all your, your boom mines there, obviously. It'll just roll over all the boom mines, wipe them all out, and that's a good thing. Uh, you kinda need it, because then you run into just all these riflemen backed up by the, the medics, which is really scary and really dangerous. Uh, if you're anything short of Max, or, you know, rocking some blues, you're gonna have a heck of a time uh, burning through this portion. Fortunately, as you can see, I was barely able to squeak through, and somehow I lucked out, and I got the medics trapped and started doing damage to them, which kind of takes them out because they're they're just, like, standing there all by themselves, not protected by anything, and then all the defenses can shoot at them and kind of polish them off, which, let's face it, is probably the easiest way to take out a whole bunch of riflemen. Unfortunately... In order to pull this all off, I also, like, I kind of really didn't change my, my defenses at all and stuff. So this this could obviously be much more efficient, but I just, I thought it was fun. I wanted the Hot Pockets to, to be the star of the show, and then Indy came and ruined it, because, well, no. Anyway, we're not going to hold it against him. He's a dog, and he smells like farts, so it's not really his fault. Well, the farts thing may be a little more so. So, um, yes, last weekend, sorry that I missed out on the crab and the hammerman and all the things, but it was still fun and I had a great time. And hopefully we'll have some more stuff for you, like obviously this. Also, a couple of weeks ago, or a week ago, I don't know, maybe it was my last video, <laughs> I just ruined the date, and I, I <laughs> thank all the people who tried to help me, but even my attempts to fix it, um, just, it did not work. It was, it was pretty bad, you know, um, some things happened, I'm not going to blame any particular individual, but someone is to blame. Bigly. Moving on. Stage 7. This is the probably the one that, you know, everybody's tuned in for. Really a pretty nasty combo. It starts off with the Grens, which, you know, if you rock the anti-Gren base, as you can see, I have switched to when I saw all the Grens that would be landing. Um, they're going to clear out the Grens, and that's all fine and dandy, but unfortunately, once those are gone, you got Riflemen and... Uh, scorchers and all kinds of craziness to deal with and I don't know if it was just bad luck or what but like holy smokes the shocks oh I tell ya Lord Tonner and Jimmy I tell ya everything um, they 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 do some horrible horrible things uh, they like at one I think it's this wave uh, three shocks all in the core like pretty much my entire base is just frozen and I was like, wow, that's really crazy. I don't know how I'm going to compete with that. Uh, because at this point, I was already thinking to myself, okay, I'm going to have to rebuild this base. I'm going to have to shovel things around. I'm going to have to change it up so that, you know, everything dies the way I want. But then I forgot, I still have a whole hot pocket sitting, just chilling and waiting. And look at the havoc that is wreaked upon these riflemen. Oh, Lord. I'm a fan. Uh, and, and, and yes, okay, some obviously uh, were able to survive, but then uh -huh, the, the back door trap, that's right, the minefield, and you can see all of the, the riflemen starting to cluster up, get nice and tight, trying to take out that last building, and then smoke. 
just smoke. Look at those bad boys poof. Anyways, guys, thanks very much for watching. Hopefully this has been helpful. Hopefully it's been entertaining. And above all else, hopefully you guys have a fantastic day.